Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Jim here from Storm Warning News with a bizarre news story out of Reedley, California, as allegedly a mysterious Chinese biolab was discovered there. What was supposed to be an empty building used only for storage was home to a black market type of lab testing facility. Now, YourCentralValley.com reported that the discovery was made after a local code enforcement officer noticed a garden hose poking out of a back wall of the building. Public health staff also observed blood, tissue, and other bodily fluid samples and serums and thousands of vials of unlabeled fluids and suspected biological material. Additionally, they found 900 genetically engineered mice engineered to catch and carry the C19er, and these mice were living in inhuman conditions. 773 of the mice had to be euthanized, and officials found 178 mice already dead. This is an unusual situation. I've been in government for 25 years. I have never seen anything like this, said Reedley City Manager Nicole Zeba. Even county officials were left in shock. I have never seen this in my 26-year career with the county of Fresno, said Assistant Director of the Fresno County Department of Public Health, Joe Prado. Now, the CDC tested the substances and detected at least 20 potentially infectious agents, including the coronavirus, HIV, hepatitis, and herpes, according to a Health and Human Services letter dated back to June 6th. Agents also found thousands of package boxes, many with shipping labels from China. NBC News reported that an investigation found the tenant was Prestige Biotech, a company registered in Nevada and unlicensed for business in California. City officials spoke with Xiao Quin Yao, who was identified as the company president through emails included in the court documents. Yao told officials that Prestige Biotech moved assets belonging to a defunct company, Universal Meditech, Inc., to the Reedley Warehouse from Fresno after UMI went under. Prestige Biotech was a creditor to UMI and identified as its successor according to court documents. Now officials were unable to get any California-based address for either company except for the previous Fresno location from which UMI had been evicted. The other addresses provided for additional authorized agents were either empty offices or addresses in China that could not be verified, court documents said. So, ladies and gentlemen, is this legit? Is this really uh, some sort of illegal bio lab connected back to China in some way? Or is this potentially a funky Frida, an untrue flag put together by uh, those who operate in the shadows here in the U.S. and potentially from the area of the Red Dragon? interesting indeed. Now, evidently, all of this mess has since been cleaned up. What are we to believe here? Certainly something very suspicious. Was there something going on here with uh, a potential bio-attack, perhaps? Weird. Strange. But please remember, the Word of God is written in Romans chapter 8, verses 38 through 39, which say, For I am persuaded that neither death nor life, nor angels, nor principalities, nor powers, nor things present, nor things to come, nor height, nor depth, nor any other created thing, shall be able to separate us from the love of God, which is in Christ Jesus our Lord. No matter what fearful situations we face in this world, ladies and gentlemen, press into Jesus with everything you have because he is all we need. This is Jim signing off. Until the next time, God bless you.